for tuning in to just me and my boy. I'm coming to y'all kind of different today. I'm coming to y'all with a reaction video. This reaction is to the LeBron James and his son saga at his basketball games. Before I get into this reaction, make sure you hit that subscribe button down low and turn your notifications on so you can get these videos as soon as they get posted. I, for those of you who don't know, LeBron James, well-known sports figure, well-known person, um, apparently he's come under scrutiny for his antics at his son's basketball game. Now, his son, amazing up-and-coming talent, the kid is going to be something, and his daddy's LeBron James. That within itself is just overwhelming news. To know that this is LeBron James and he has his son coming up and his son look promising. That's one thing I can say. His son really look like he's going to be something. But, you know, the, the crazy part is um, how LeBron James react when he goes to his games. He's chest bumping his son, cheering on his son and his son's teammates. At one point, he was even cheering the other team when another player's made. Um, he's getting the layup line, giving the people a show. You know, typical things that, you know, a father does. But because it's LeBron James, people feel like something is wrong with it. So the issue everybody is having is they said LeBron should just sit down. <laughs> and enjoy the game and be quiet. For what? The man is watching his son play the game that he loves. Not only he's watching him play, but his son is thriving in it. And for those people who's, who's, who's telling him to sit down, like, do you have kids? Do you understand what it means to support your child? Do you know, understand what it means to be in the stands, making noise, and your child know that you're there to support them? I don't think I understand what that means. And then, just look at the tail end of it. This is LeBron James. You never see no scams about him. The man is an a, a outstanding citizen. The man helps out the community. The man opened up his own school. The man is a great father. So why can't he celebrate his children? I don't get that. Like, what's wrong with him celebrating his children? You know, how many, how many players you think that be at these basketball games, the actual players that don't have nobody there to watch them play. Fathers. It's a lot of players, if, if you pay attention to these games, and I've been a witness to this, I've coached basketball, and I've witnessed this where there's no fathers involved in these players' lives. So you don't think that's something? You don't think his son enjoy his father being there? You don't think LeBron is breaking the stereotype for black fathers? They're already saying we're not there. They're already saying all these crazy things about us. So what's, what's the issue? <laughs> I don't understand what's the issue. It's not like he's uh, embarrassing the other team or he's making other players or other parents uncomfortable. If anything, he's entertaining the people that's there because he's LeBron James. You know, you can't get other people to do what he's doing. And for him to be the type of person that he is, the magnitude of person he is, and still willing to do those things, that even says more about this man. Unfortunate for me, growing up, I had no support. I wasn't fortunate to have not one person at my game. Do you know how that would have made me feel for me to see somebody in the stands there for me? <laughs> you don't think I would have played harder, ran faster, just for that person that's there to watch me? which is why I am the way I am with my kids. I am LeBron James. I, when I go to my kids' game, I'm yelling, I'm doing all that because I understand how important it is for me to do that. I didn't have it growing up. So I know how important it is for me to be there on a consistent basis, for them to know that I'm there, for them, for me to yell the way I yell and enjoy and give them this positive energy. That's all LeBron is doing, injecting positive energy in the building, and his kids. And all of us can take note of this as fathers. All of us can take note of this. Be there for your kids. Don't just be there just to be there. Be there and let everybody know you're there. Being there is only part of it. 
Because I see some parents that's there in their phones, <laughs> doing everything else that matters but watching the game. No, he's there. He's chest bumping. He's standing up. He's shouting. He's screaming. He's, he's engaging in the game, which makes it even better to be in. Come on, man. This is what we come to. This is what we come to. You're being criticized for supporting your child now. <laughs> what can we do? So what is he supposed to do? He's supposed to just be quiet. Great job, son. Good play. Good hustle. Nah, man. This is LeBron James. I'm going to yell. I'm going to do all that. I'm going to scream. I'm going to chest bump. I'm going to do all that. For those of you who have a problem with what LeBron James is doing, I think you need to check yourself. Because what he's doing is what's needed. He's a father and he's there. <laughs> that's, that's what's missing right now. For other reasons, some fathers just can't be to the game, whether they're working, going through problems. or like, Remember, he's black. There's a large percentage of black men that's locked up and they can't see their kids play. So you don't think this is something serious, what he's doing? Come on, man. Look into yourself, man. Get out your ways. Listen, I'm a Heat fan. <laughs> yeah, I got issues with LeBron James. He left us. I'm a Heat fan. But that don't have nothing to do with him as a man, as a father, as a husband, as a community activist, as all that. Listen, he's top in my book and all that. And that's just respect out of who this man is. So for him to be in that setting and be as normal as the other parent and even more animated sometimes, I can see, I can see if he was affecting the game. I can see if he was being rude, disrespectful, you know what I'm saying? Taunting other players, taunting other parents because he's LeBron James. But nah, he's not doing none of that. He's simply, he's celebrating his son representing that last name right. And that's pride. When you see all that yelling and all that screaming, all that chest bumping, that's pride for that name that his son is carrying around. Don't look at it as LeBron James, he needs to sit down. How dare you say this man needs to sit down and don't support his son? You hear stuff about all these other players, all type of scandals, all type of um, babies being born out of wedlock, all type of uh, infidelities, just all type of stuff. But here you don't hear none of that with LeBron James. He's just a man living his life to the best of his ability and making sure his family is taken care of. What's wrong with that? My question to y'all is, do y'all feel LeBron James is out of line with his actions at his son's game? Do you feel it's too much? Comment down below and let me know what your reactions is or let me know what your feelings are. And if you're a father or you're a parent that's at these youth games and you see these parents that are like this, how does it make you feel? Comment down below. This is an interesting topic. I can't see why there's an outrage over it. Y'all help me understand. But until next time, man, don't forget to subscribe. And this is my reaction to the LeBron James antics. All right? See y'all later, man. Just me and my boys. Better yet. I'm a father. Better yet. I'm a cool. Better yet.